Yes, we finally have new multiverses gameplay to show off today. As an Arya main, it was so exciting to see new Arya gameplay. And then just this morning, we got new Gizmo gameplay. Let's break it down and see what's new. Let's go ahead and just watch this clip at full speed, shall we? This is Arya's new gameplay from the beginning, what they show off. So it looks like she had just died and she came back. She's dropping on the stage. And look at just how fast she just KOs Rain Dog. Hit, face still, cancel, combo down, uses Rain Dog's fireball, down air again, up up special up attack ko that is absolutely insane and we gotta we gotta slow that down just a little bit you know what i'm saying so we're gonna go at a half speed here so the full combo you see right there right out the gate she likes to cancel she just uh cancels right into the attack so it looks like either she dodged or she canceled into the attack um to start it off and fate i love this all right here she face steals she basically for those that did not play the beta for multiverses this move right here for Arya would steal an opponent's uh of face their guys and then she could use either you know she can neutral face steal again later and stun your opponent but here it looks like you can do it in a combo and i say that because it was really hard to actually utilize inside of a combo before so it looks like you can actually attack and then face steal. So right there, we have the stolen face right here, which is awesome. She canceled face steal. So she actually uh, used face steal, cancel to continue the combo while the opponent is still in hit stun from the face steal to attack them again. So it looks like we attack, face steal, attack, attack, face steal, cancel, attack again, up special, down air, which is an awesome combo. Love to see that still going. And then she immediately down specials, but uses Rain Dog's Fireball, which if I remember correctly was his down special. So she's using that inside the combo right here. The face steal goes away. So it looks like it only uses one stock, I guess you could say. Like you don't get to use multiple moves from one face. So you get one face steal. Then you can use your opponent's move whether it be in a combo or not but she's using it here in a combo to use the fireball to bounce him down again down airs again up attack before she lands so she bounced him using the down air uses up attack then she lands jumps up specials into an up attack in the air oh my gosh absolutely insane and then this perk right here she drops the pie so whenever she kills her opponent the pie will do a special effect on either her or her opponent giving them speed or or damage i think it was so i think the big things to take away here is using face steal in a combo super easy in my opinion like you're gonna be able to attack face steal cancel that face still into another attack that as an Arya main makes me so excited to see so we face still cancel attack up special one more time just down air down special rain dog down air again up attack in the air land jump up special up attack what what a combo man what what a combo from the start from the get-go using a face still. so this brings up a couple questions right like does that face still like what like what moves does it steal from your opponent do you get to choose the moves is always down special is it like when you steal the move like can you choose in the moment what it takes or is it like predetermined like do you go through a menu and say i want to choose this move that i steal from this character so if i ever fight a batman i'm going to pick his batarang not his grapple move like do you get to choose i doubt it but like the fact that we still move and we can use in combos like that is just super cool. I think that's what's really going to make Arya stand out. Like, be able to face to your opponent, use their moves like that inside of a combo, bro. And then just continuing it. And her mobility just looks beautiful. The one thing I will say right there on the up special, right, right there. So this exact frame, um, I'm not quite... I mean, I'm glad it's not hitting Rain Dog as, as, as you know, he's beneath her. But he is. This hitbox ranges to the very edge of her blade so right freaking here if, if this blade touches your freaking toe uh you're gonna get smacked with it and it carries him upwards again it just looks like this move's hitbox is gonna be large i wonder if they'll ever fix that it's not a problem i don't think it's meant to like grab your opponent drag him upwards with you so i kind of get it but that uh, that did catch my attention when i first saw this also side note the the fireball that Arya shot by using rain dog's moves is still on the floor causing fire damage still later in the fight it looks like so she uses it in a combo and still had a has a fire trap set on the floor for, for the rest of the match not not like the rest of the match but you know until its duration is over this made me super excited as an Arya main man i i can't wait to see how she plays how all the other characters play what they can do how the fights are actually going to play out between all these characters all the interactions we're going to see 
it's gonna be just amazing now the other big new gameplay that we were shown today was actually gizmo versus superman uh gizmo was not in my opinion from what you know what i saw my experience was not a very popular character he's a great support character not everyone plays support let alone knows even who gizmo is let's let's go and just be honest but i think he's a fun awesome support character and it, it looks really cool to see him get some what i think are buffs in this new gameplay we were shown today and i'll show you what it looks like so let's go and just show off the the, the clip at full speed and then we'll break it down down again for you there's a couple notes here that i want to go over but but here's the full clip for gizmo bow down again smash him bow dude down special bow again jump cancel oh my gosh bro so the notes that i want to go over is again the beginning right here he dashed or he canceled again i think he dashed i think that was more of a dash move saw the armor by the way this is an armored move so take note of what happens here superman is doing an armored punch Gizmo sees it coming from a mile away. He goes, oh, boom, armored attack. Watch this. And then he decides to parry it. Parries the move. I love that parry animation for Gizmo. Hilarious. But for those that do not see this, that parry broke the armored move. I wouldn't say like broke the armor, but it really just like negates it. Like it's like, oh, armor doesn't matter. right? And I think this was confirmed in the dev Q&A they did the other day that parries will actually do that. They will break slash negate armored moves. So that is a brand new way to get around armor. And we see it in action right here. So he parries it, continues the, you see that dude, he has so much, what it feels like so much time. He parries the move. Superman is stunned. Gizmo can jump to do down attack to start the combo, starts it. Pulls out the bow. He's dude. The bow is is utilized in this combo like what three or four times. There's one. Jumps again. Down attack again. Then bows again on the way down to push him to the side. Jumps up down special in the air. After that we have another bow attack. But right there he canceled the bow attack. You see this? So after the bow attack hit. He does it again, cancels, jump. So is that a jump cancel or is that like a dash jump? You see what I'm saying? Like, did he did he cancel the bow into a jump? Or like, you know, I'm, I'm assuming he canceled it to have the frames to be able to jump and continue the combo is what I'm assuming he did. He, he just rolled cancel. He probably like dodge canceled there. He, he did the bow, dodge cancel. That way he could jump faster than Superman could recover jumps and up specials for the KO. That, that is really cool. So, you know, not only can you like cancel combos from the ground, but of course in the air like that, this parry right here. I, I can't believe it, man. So he, he called it so perfectly, saw the armor, negates the armor, has the time to start a combo in the air, down attack, bow, down attack again, bow again, jump up again, down special, bow, and then again, like dash cancel here, well, bow, and then dash cancel, jump up special for the KO. So dude, it looks like the combos in this game are gonna be insane. So, you know, kind of a, you're, you're kind of SOL if you're Superman here, and you go for the armor, like, oh, I, I'm gonna hit this, I got this. If you see this and you're like, oh, Oh, well, I'm Perry. Like, if you're Superman right here, you might as well just pack your bags and go home, man, because game over. So, really high risk, high reward, first of all, for armored moves, it looks like now, and high risk, high reward for parries. Because if you miss the parry, you're going to get punished super hard, right? So, but if you land the parry, now you get rewarded for that. And it looks like the reward is the game, because you're going to combo them like crazy. Like, if you if you, if you know how to land this, yo, props to you. And, and, and the big question I have you know, we're seeing this combo from Gizmo and then the combo we saw from Ari just, just, just a minute ago. The big question I have is like, is this combo starting at zero damage? Cause this is a platform fighter that is based off of percentages life, right? So, you know, the higher damage you have on you, if you're at 50 or 75 or hundred percent damage, you essentially will have higher knockback from certain moves. Like if you play Super Smash Brothers, you're very familiar with this, obviously and other platform fighters, of course. So I'm wondering if this combo right here is from zero or if Superman started, you know, here here at like 20 health or 50 percent health or anything like that was he higher damage so that way this combo could kill or is this, is this a true zero to death combo right here and i wonder that same thing for Arya's combo as well like how far in the fight is Arya right here to be able to kill rain dog with this combo you know what i'm saying again is rain dog at zero is he at 20 percent health is he at 50 percent health i think during the dev q a they stated that moves are essentially just more powerful so you will have uh like like combo 
combos like this that will kill faster. Moves have higher kill potential with the character size and the character weight and the speed of the game. They did kind of state that. So I, I, I want to believe that this is a zero to death combo and maybe all characters have stuff like that you can land it right. Arya starts off with a dash cancel into a hit with a face stone the combo, whereas Gizmo started off with a parry and a parry to an armored move, which is awesome. Let me know your thoughts on the dash cancels we've seen here on parries and parries to armored moves and the combos. What are all your thoughts? What do you think this is at? Do you think the character, do you think the opponent here is at 0% health and this is a true zero to death combo? What are your thoughts on parries? Let me know all this down below, guys. Multiverses does relaunch on May 28th. So if you want to stay up to date with all the new stuff coming out from Multiverses, all the gods, news, tutorials, and more, subscribe here for the best of it. Take it one step at a time and go ahead and click into this playlist right here for more Multiverses content.